What up, it's your boy T Bird on the reaction. I'm um, sorry it took a little while. I've been doing the reaction vid, but I had a little busy waiting. Plus, as of late, my MacBook back and real funny. So, hopefully, in the moment that I got re get replacement or not. Anyway, let's get to some reaction bit. Now, there's one video I was going to just watch on my own, but I decided to react to it because I can feel this person with this. So, Tyron Man's made a video about his people, people that watch this video insult his guests. Now, y'all know me, I dealt with people insulting me, of course. I barely have guests on here. The only person I got guests was my girlfriend at the time. You know, somebody thought that was my mama. I don't know how. Anyway, but yeah. Not cool to be insulting somebody you guess when they're um they have somebody over, especially you get a girl the female like with Tyron Mads, a lot of people we have like female um guests over there they be wanted if you sleep with or you banging her though. I mean I be thinking he's lucky though, but I don't go too far thinking like, oh, is he banging her and all that like they be, that's not sound a little thirsty in my opinion. So let's check out this video about by Tyron Mads about his fans is that people that watch this video insult his guests. Possibly they are. So maybe some of you can actually help me out in the comment section and let me know what would possess somebody to do this. Okay. So, you know, I've never spoken on this before. I've been doing years, I mean, videos for almost seven years now. So it's like, wow, seven wow, years. You know, and I've covered a lot of topics, made a lot of videos about things. Things that I like, things that piss me off, things that irritate me, whatever. A lot of times people are like, yo, man, you ain't gotta make a video about that, don't worry about it, we still cool with you now. I feel like I still need to voice myself whenever I feel like it, so. Um, ever since I've had my first guest on my show, which was my ex-girlfriend, from her on, there is a segment of my subscriber base that considers them that considers themselves loyal subscribers that actually like me not the dummy trolls that actually subscribe to me and follow me so they can just thumb down the video or comment mm -hmm. say something slick you know what I mean not those dumbasses but I mean this is another form of dumbass these are the people that actually praise me in my videos yo you know I've seen them several of them for months Mm -hmm. I recognize their profile, you know what I mean? For months or for years on end, I've seen them, yo, I love your videos, yo, you, you're the best, yo, you're the reason why I watch YouTube, because I watch your videos, yo, you brighten my day, yo, you're the greatest, yo, you're so cool, Tyrone, yo, I wish I was friends with you, yo, if you're ever in Seattle, hang with me. These same people, after I have a guest on, will come and say, don't bring that motherfucker on. They're fucking stupid. I'm still down with you. Keep doing what you do. Wow. Don't bring that tranny on here no more. Don't bring that bitch on no more. The fuck? Fuck this stupid bitch. Why the fuck did you bring her on, Tyrone? Wow. Hey, yo, this dude talked too fucking much. Why do you even have him on here? Wow. Yo, Tyrone, he's your friend. What the fuck is wrong with you? Hey, yo... Something's wrong with this bitch's hair. Hey, yo, what's wrong with this bitch's face? Hey, yo, this bitch look like Michael Jackson. Hey, yo, this bitch look like a skeleton. Hey, yo, look at this bitch's teeth. Hey, yo, look at... Like, y'all... I know it boggles my mind. Wow. Every time someone who considers themselves a fan to come and run their fucking mouths about... That's ridiculous. My, um, about my guests. And I could go down the line naming all the guests I've had. And literally all but maybe, maybe one or two that I can think of. I've never seen somebody come to a video and talk shit. And it probably was because they weren't in too many videos with me. They weren't in enough. But I want you to know, as fans of mine, that when you insult my guests insult me because every single person I've had on my show 
is anywhere from a good friend to someone who is a great acquaintance. Okay? I put everybody that I'm cool with on my show. Everyone that I like is on my show. I don't bring people on my show that I have a problem with. Why would I do that? Because facts. So when you come on and you comment something disrespectful and you find out you're banned and then you're writing me, trying to find me, you know, on different social media platforms or email. Tyrone, I got banned. I don't know why I got banned. What did I do? Because you dumbass. You insulted my friend. You insulted my colleague. You insulted someone I'm doing business one with. Someone I'm collabing with. You dumbass. How stupid can you be? <laughs> I, like I have to be. ban somebody at least once a week if I have somebody on the show. Damn. And I say that's at least. You know, I could ban, ban five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten Damn. people. You know what I mean? Depending on what the video is about, what we're talking about. I just can't believe it. So I just had to make the video. So you know, you loyal fans that like me so much, all right, learn how to respect people. Because guess what? You wouldn't walk up to me on the street and say to me, hey, yo, you cool, I hate this motherfucker, don't have him on your show no more. But hey, this bitch talks too much, don't have her on your show no more. You cool though, Tyrone, I ain't kidding. You wouldn't do it in person. You wouldn't. Every single one of you wouldn't do it, okay? So, from there, then the video, okay? Did some other things that I had to talk about that. I just I found it weird. I just had to do it to somebody on Instagram. I was just like, oh, okay, you're you're a fucking. Because I look at the profile, I'm like, they actually follow me. They actually been following me. I've had recognized them. I've seen them before. Comments. Post comments down below. Let me know what you all think. And if you enjoyed my video, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Woo! Yeah. Wow. That's ridiculous. Like. This is like people take the internet too too fucking far. That's what it is. This is people taking that internet shit too far. Like they figure like because they're behind screen or anything, they do the fuck they want, say what the fuck they want, and disrespect be disrespect people because they think they can. That's just, that's ridiculous. And the fact that your fans and your fans doing that, that's also fucking ridiculous too. Like, like this is this is. I just don't, that's why I just like about how people are these, especially this time of day, like this, this, this day, these days are like, people are so bad, want to be known as being petty or savage, they gotta show their ass on people's, um, on people's uh, profile videos, Instagram, etc. They gotta show their ass on social media pretty much. It's ridiculous. It's cause they, they are proud of being petty or proud of being savage, like even though they're a fan of the person, they gotta disrespect somebody else though which is not knowing that could be the respect for the person you're a fan of for real so yeah not cool don't be assaulting Tyrone Mass Fest don't assault my guests and don't assault me I'm saying don't be a dick on my on again on my videos and assault me or other people's in the in their videos just because you feel like being a dick you feel like it's feel good to be a dick or you feel like it's feel good to be wherever don't do it. You feel the urge to be a dick, stay the fuck off, off people's off page. Because that's how you get banned. And truthfully, that's how you get your ass kicked. And uh, most other things, if people are that, people are, are, are people, because, you know, you might be messing with the wrong person who's a violent enough to whoop ass and if you haven't found you. So, yeah. You must love getting your ass kicked if you like being a dick or, or, or like being a dick or asshole or the B word. So, anyway. It's your boy T-Bird signing off. One love.